Hello everybody, I'm back with another episode of The Binding of Isaac Rebirth, and... Last round was terrible. Was it? I can't remember what the last round was. I think it was terrible, but we're gonna random anyway. Um, let's see what we get. We got Lazarus. Lazarus is alright. Um, you know, not super good, not super bad. Curse of the Maze is annoying, but not detrimental, so I think we're, we're gonna be okay with that. Uh, Troll Bomb... Cool. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go into the curse room because we got that. Oh, and look, it was well worth it. I will take the flying and the two black hearts. Uh, it's kind of gay because now we're gonna lose half a black heart, but that's okay, I guess. I'm actually gonna see what this pill is. I found pills, no big deal. Uh, got a big room here. This is why Curse of the Maze is annoying. Got a big room here. You're kidding, right? Got a big room here. Thank you. Uh, but this is one of the easier big rooms, in my opinion. Other than hoppers are slightly unpredictable, but mostly predictable. Those big dudes that, that fart on you are... I don't understand the point of them really, because there's like a very, very low chance that they're going to do damage. Because they only really do damage if they touch you, but their main attack is to push you away from them. So I don't understand that, but oh well. You know, it's their problem, not mine. Lost contact. Shielded tears are good, for the most part. Uh, they can occasionally... I got hit, that's no good. They can occasionally be bad, but for the most part, they're pretty alright. Um, I am actually going to look around for a tinted rock, just in case I missed one. Uh, I'm not going to look too hard, so I guess we're not going to get one. And the boss is Famine. Famine's alright. Um, famine's really not a big deal at all. Uh, so I guess we'll just, we'll wear him down slowly. Um, I don't know why I took so much time, uh, shooting that fly. I should probably just focus on him. Oh, shit. Came a little further than I thought he was going to. Jeez, he is just spawning the flies. Kind of surprised I didn't get hit there, but, you know. I'm glad I didn't. I'm going to take out some of these flies, except I'm just hitting their bullets. That's why shielded tears is sometimes not, not the best thing. And you know what? Awesome. As soon as as soon as soon I, I take out his flies, he spawns two more. But he did end up killing them both. Unless I killed that last one. Alright, now this is where... This is where the fight gets enormously easy, especially since I have shielded tears. Except... <laughs> I almost keep dodging into that bottom tier there when he shoots. But that was good. We didn't take any damage. Got ball of bandages for a little protection. And we're on to the next floor. So all in all, a good floor for me, if I do say so. Uh, we got a boss trap room. I don't think I'm ready for that. Maybe if I get some extra damage, uh, perhaps in this item room. Homing Tears, not extra damage, but still a good pickup, so that's good. Um, we do have the Black Heart buffer. So I will try and find the boss room as, as fast as I possibly can. This is going to be difficult. Perhaps. Maybe I can just stand here. Maybe it's going to be really easy. They're not going to be able to hit me with their tears anyway. Oh, that one almost hit me. Uh, one second. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, I am trying... That was pointer on the screen. My bad. I am trying to look for tinted rocks, but I'm only kind of looking for them. So Actually, there's one right there. Awesome. As soon as I say it, one appears. And we get a spirit heart. Bit more of a safety buffer, which I'm extremely happy with. I don't think I can outrange this guy. I think I've, yeah, I have pretty 
shitty range. But the shielded tiers will uh, block any incoming shots from them anyway, so it's not like it's a big deal. Um, I guess we'll go to the big room. This is full of these uh, not so nice flies, but if we can just, you know, take them out without them freaking out too much, that should be alright. No, and I did get hit, so that's not good. We are doing very low damage. Which, um... Not exactly what I like to be doing in this game. I don't... And we have really, really low range. So it's not like I can just outrange these fools. I guess I can a little, but not really. This poop is getting in the way. Spectral tears would be nice, to be honest with you. I found pills. I don't see the harm in taking them one more time. Uh, I will look around for a tinted rock, which I don't see. Uh, and we already got the item room, so I'm just going to go fight the boss. Hopefully we'll get a deal with the devil, which uh, we should. I don't see us taking three hits of damage on um, Mahomie Monstro here. Especially with shielded tears, because that's... As I'm saying, why well, we're not going to take damage. But especially with shielded tears, because they're going to block, you know, at least some of the incoming fire from Monstro, but I guess I shouldn't rely on them. Uh, the low range is kind of hurting us. Because when we go to dodge, we kind of have to go back a bit, but we could try and get in there and hit them with a. Uh, Ball of bandages a bit, but I, I'm not. Th I'm not that brave. Um, let's see if we can keep him in this jump in pattern. That'll help. There we go. He's dead. And we did get a deal with the devil and a range up, which you know I was just complaining about range. So, so I'm gonna take the pact. You can take two heart deals if you only have one heart. So that'll put us down to no hearts, but it'll give us no red hearts. But it gave us two spirit hearts, which I'm happy with. Uh, we're going to go down to the next floor, because I don't see the point in exploring anymore. We're not going to go to the shop, so... Uh, and I might do that curse room. Possibly. And that tears... I think it's a... I can't remember if the pact is a tears and damage up, but it's definitely a tears up, because we're shooting a lot faster. So even if it's just a tears up, that's... Very welcome, considering. And I actually love that we have shielded tears for this guy, these guys, because those bones, so annoying. The health up is awesome. Means we could trade it to a deal with the devil this floor, possibly, or we could just have the extra health. And I love rooms like this where it's like, if I get hit, it's definitely my own fault because there is. Areas in this room where it's impossible to get hit and still do damage, so. Take that red heart. Uh, another fairly easy room. We're getting really lucky with the uh, room rolls. We haven't had uh, too many rooms where it's, you know, certain that we're going to take damage, which does tend to happen to me a lot because. Now, this is one of the rooms where we could take damage, but. Usually it's unlikely. There we go. So we didn't. So that's good. Oh, I don't know. I'll take it because I don't think I've had it before. But this could be a run ender for us. I don't know. Actually, with shielded tears, that's very good. Well, not very good because we're going to be doing zero damage, but we shouldn't. Actually, we're not. The damage isn't that bad. They die pretty quick. But we're going to block everything, because we have so many damn tears. Now, of course, it doesn't make a difference to uh, enemies like this that primarily do melee damage. But I do like this, because you know, I'm pretty bad at aiming in this game. So having this onslaught of tears makes it you know, less important for me to actually aim my shots. So we're going to fight Chubb. Actually, I haven't fought Chubb in like a really long time. Uh, and uh, the main benefit that I said we're getting from this uh, soy milk. What the fuck? He is just. Alright, so Chubb is 
hella fast. I guess that's this champion version is just is just really fast. So I gotta I gotta be on my A game, I guess. Cause he is a he's a charging monster. Um, but as I was saying, the main benefit that I said we get from the soy milk shielded tears synergy is that we can block a lot of shots, which the game immediately gives us a uh, a boss that shoots no shots and does damage by primarily by you know eating your face. So, it's, um, I would like to get these uh, little guys dead. That that would be possible. I don't want to have to dodge chub and bullets. Mind you, I guess the bullets aren't a big deal. We'll probably block them. Now, we didn't get a deal with the devil, which I'm a little disappointed about, but... Um, we have done the item room. I don't really want to do the curse room with this low of HP, but I will explore a bit for the possibility of a tinted rock. And again, enemies where the... Uh, Shielded Tears Soy Milk combo is going to be um, not entirely productive. Although it was easy to kind of steer them away from me with the, the knockback from all the tears. And at this point I guess we just want a lot of damage and uh, some sort of health regeneration. Mm, I don't know if I want to go into the... How many... So we got no more rooms left, so I will use a bomb to look for the secret room. Which we found. Awesome. Get a bit of money. So I guess I will go to the shop because we will be able to buy an item if one presents itself. Uh, Mom's purse will buy. It's a good investment. Um... You know, we don't have any trinkets right now, but, you know, if we find two good ones, then, you know, double the good, right? We won't have to decide between which one we want. So it could be could be good, very good for us in the future. It could be useless, I suppose. But uh, I'm willing to um, bet my money on the possibility that it could be very good. Uh, I'll check in here. Normal chest. Don't know if I want to fight it. Lust shouldn't be a problem. With all the knockback we have, Lust will barely, barely be moving. Well, unless he decides to, you know, go a different way. That's very smart of you. Our damage isn't the best. Ooh, Poison Touch is nice. Uh, our damage isn't the best. Enemies are dying, but, um, not, not, enormously fast. And the problem with this type of enemy is that if I get close to them and they launch one of their tears, it'll immediately blow up because of the shielded tears. And it could blow up in my face. But, you know, as long as I keep my distance and be patient. Oh, bad trip is really like one of the worst things that could have just happened to me. I love the ability to fly to get around that room. Uh, like, I haven't taken very much damage this run, but being at one heart is a little scary. I could kill myself and get a damage up from Lazarus's, you know, Lazarus, if you if you, if you kill him once, he uh, is respawned with a, a damage upgrade. I don't think it's too much of a damage upgrade, but, you know, it's a damage upgrade nonetheless, and we can use all the damage we can get right now. So, you know, if I die, I'm not going to try and die, because uh, I ain't about that life. But if I do happen to die, then, um, you know, it's not that big of a deal. I'm liking our speed right now, so I actually, I don't really want any more speed upgrades. You know, unless they come with some other positive effect, you know, such as like a, a speed. I guess shot speed isn't even really that beneficial for us right now either. But like, I don't know, a speed damage upgrade. I don't know if there's any speed damage upgrades in the game, but if there is, I would still take it for the damage. And we don't really have any money. I don't want to waste a bomb blowing them up. Mm. 
Okay, I'm glad that guy died. I uh, really, um, even more so than damage, to be honest. Well, actually, no. Damage is not still number one priority, but HP is definitely a close second. I, I'm really not comfortable being at this uh, one HP mark. Scorpio Poison Tears is very good. We should, with our fire rate, we should be constantly poisoning fools. Hanged Man is 100% useless. I wonder if... Yeah. Poison Tears helps it a lot. Let's just say that. Ooh, and we are going to get a bunch of money from this room. Which kind of makes me sad that I wasted my key on the... Uh, the golden chest there, but, you know, what can you do? Even with the poison, we're still, still not killing enemies quite as fast as I'd like to. So, it's no good. Now, oh no, that's not going to be possible, okay. I was going to check to see if the secret room was there, but... Okay, so we're fighting the Fallen. If we live through this, we will, uh possibly be in a good position. I almost dodged right into that tier, which is not not something I want to do. Ooh. Oh, I got hit. Okay, so that's bad. That's that's really bad. Both of these guys are going to shoot brimstones. Oh, and I died. That's okay. We'll come back as Lazarus. With more damage and the same amount of HP that I just have. And I died. Fuck! Oh, that could have been such a good run. We got the nail, too. Oh, that would have been HP. Oh, I'm salty about that. God damn it. Anyways, thanks for watching, and uh, hopefully I get better at this game. Um, if you enjoyed it, you know, hit the like button, and uh, subscribe if you want to see more. Uh, again, thanks for watching.